you for bringing the palm branches up here. Now, I know you know why you did this. You did it because I told you you had to. Oh, see, I mean, she'd have been in bigger trouble. She was going to get grounded if she didn't do it. I thought maybe she'd break your other arm. <laughs> no, she has a broken arm. She broke it in school. So, But, you know, we do these things in church, and we don't even know why we do them. Do you know why we did it? Be what? Yes, exactly. Jesus rode into Jerusalem on the donkey, and they grabbed palm branches, and they waved them. Now, I know you were coming in, so you probably weren't paying attention to that song very much that we just sang, but it kind of explained why they did it. Because I never wave, wave palm branches around. Do you, you do that, Caleb? No! Oh! No, I don't wave them around. They're kind of prickly. They're not very nice. And you could hurt somebody with them. You know. But that's what they did to show honor to Jesus who was riding on the donkey. It just seems so strange to me. Doesn't it seem strange to you that they'd wave palm branches in order to show honor to him? They were greeting him as king. So if a king came into a city and they knew he was coming, they would want to show honor to him by waving palm branches. That's the way they did it. Now, we don't do that today. But we did it this morning in order to remember what happened when Jesus came in as king king. And so they wanted to say to him, greetings as king. And they shouted, save us, because only he could save us. There's, it's interesting to me that in the temple, they had engraved in the temple palm trees. And I think there was something there that was important because when they did this in the festival times before Jesus, then they would go up to the temple where there were palm branches and that showed life and peace and the presence of God, the creator of all that is, the palm trees. So they would wave the palm branches. But on this day, Palm Sunday, we're remembering that event when Jesus came in, rode the donkey, they waved the palm branches. Now, something interesting about the passage that we're going to have this morning, it doesn't mention that. They waved the palm branches. All other Gospels talk about the palm branches, but in our passage, it only talks about them putting their cloaks on the donkey and their cloaks on the road. That doesn't mean they didn't do the palm branches. Obviously they did. The other ones tell us about it. So I wanted you to know that. And maybe there's a few adults here who didn't even realize why we do this. Because it's Palm Sunday. And that's why we call it Palm Sunday. Because next week is what day? Easter Sunday. That's right. And we celebrate the resurrection of Jesus Christ. But in between... We remember his death. So on Friday, we're all going to get together, and we're going to remember the death of Jesus Christ on our behalf. So thanks for coming up here. I'm going to pray a minute, and then you can go back where your parents are waiting eagerly for your return. <laughs> Let's pray a moment. Father, we thank you for all these children. We thank you for the children who waved palm branches before you and sang with loud voices and shouted Hosanna. So thank you for them, and may we all praise you always as our King. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Ooh.